In this video, I'll show you how to bring samples into GarageBand for iOS projects and how to play them using the apps sampler. First off, we'll learn how to import a MIDI or audio sample into GarageBand for iOS's tracks view. I have some sample packs downloaded already, they're in the downloads folder of my iPads files app. I'll put some links to some free sample packs in the description as well, so you can try this out for yourself for free. In GarageBand's tracks view, note you need to have created at least one track to access the tracks view. I need to head to the loop browser here. From the browser, I'll tap on the Files tab at the top. And here is where samples I want to use will be imported to. This menu acts as sort of a middleman as you can, not for example, drag and drop files directly from the Files app. You need to bring samples into here first and then import them into your GarageBand project. To add my sample, I need to tap on Browse Items from the Files app here. In the files window that appears, I can select where on my iPad or iCloud drive I want to bring my samples in from. I'll select Downloads and then select this pack here. In this file, I can tap to select the sample I want to bring in. The file I selected will now appear in the Files tab of GarageBand's Loop Browser and I can just drag and drop it into my project. This is a MIDI sample, so GarageBand automatically loads up the default piano instrument on the track that is created. But I can change the instrument here to whatever I want. This works in exactly the same way for audio samples, though GarageBand will create an audio track when you import it instead of the instrument track it created for the MIDI sample. Adding audio samples to GarageBand Sampler in order to play them works in a very similar way. From the instrument selection screen, I need to select Sampler from the keyboard menu. Next, I need to tap on the currently loaded sample and in this menu on import. The same menu we used before pops up and I can select to import Apple loops to the sampler, any non-copyright protected and locally stored songs from the music app, or the files tab where again, I need to tap on browse items from the files app to access my samples. Just like before, I'll tap on Downloads, find the pack I want, and select the sample to bring it into the Files tab. Once it's here, I then need to tap on it and it will be added to GarageBand Sampler. From here, I can use the sampler's keys to play the imported sample and hit Record to record it to my project. I can also edit my imported sample using GarageBand's sampler instrument. For more info on how that works, give that like button a good hard slap and then watch this next. <laughs> 